Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my finals week in a life edition. I don't really know. I'm a sophomore at the University of Kansas. Go Jayhawks. Um, and I am studying human biology um, and English on the pre-med track and I also have a minor in WGSS. So I have a lot kind of going on in my radar, you know. But anyways, I am just going to be vlogging this week in my life. Today is Monday. It is currently 7.52 a.m. and my first final is Portuguese at 9 a.m. and right now I'm just going to start studying for it. But yeah, I just wanted to start off this video. Okay guys, hello. It is currently 2 p.m. 2.22 p.m. and I always do this and just always forget to vlog at like things that I could be vlogging at but basically my final literally took 10 minutes. My Portuguese class is done for the semester very grateful that that class is over with and now I can like focus on other classes um so I was really glad like that class is not something that I had a lot of stress over and so yeah anyways and then after that I went to the union which is just like our union <laughs> I don't know it's a KU it has all of like the KU bookstore it has dining hall in there it just has a lot of neat th things in there and I actually finished a book and then my friends came over, all of the guys and then Libby. Uh, today is actually Libby's birthday. We all ate lunch because Libby has a lot of dining dollars left. And then she actually bought us all a whole bunch of stuff. So I'm going to show it real fast. I got this Hydro Flask. I think I might give this to my little brother. I don't know. Or I might use it. I'm not sure yet. But it's like red, which isn't really my vibe, but it could be my little brother's. Anyways, Hydro Flask. Got some Reese's because I've been craving them. Also got some Cliff Bars. Got two different flavors of Tic Tacs. I think I got six Mintos. Um, so yeah, Libby. Shout out to Libby. Um, she still has like $550 left, so um, I am going to be using her money. I actually just got done canceling my debit card, which I'm a little confused on because if... I'm not getting a new debit card for like a week. What about all my subscriptions that like are gonna get charged to that credit card? Is it gonna automatically go to the new account? Or like, I don't really know. I didn't ask, maybe I should have asked, but maybe I can get a temporary card. And it's also like a week until Christmas, um, two weeks until Christmas. And I, hmm, less than two weeks from Christmas and now I have no access to my money. I am just chilling. I need to actually go to the bathroom real fast and I want to work out. My watch didn't charge overnight for some reason, so I'm charging it right now and then I'm going to do a workout. And yeah, that's the update right now. Hello guys, it is Tuesday, finals week. It is currently 11.30. Actually, I'm doing such a bad job at vlogging. I am trying to show more than tell, but obviously that has not happened yet. So I'm going to try to be better for the rest of this vlog. But since I didn't vlog earlier or yesterday, I'm just going to basically tell you what I did. I remember the last time I vlogged yesterday, I think I told you guys that I ate uh, lunch with my friends. And like I said, I did not vlog that, which I wish I had of. Um, and then I showed you a little haul. I can't remember if I vlogged anything else besides that. But basically what I did is I just kind of hung out. Um, uh, Libby and I actually watched The Hating Game. It was my second time watching it. I watched it literally on Sunday. And then I watched it again yesterday on Monday. And it was her first time watching it. And honestly, I really liked it. I think what is good about it is that I kind of have separated the movie and the book. So either one doesn't ruin the other, if that makes sense. Um... But, like, it, I feel like it's my new, like, comfort movie. And it's kind of, like, holiday. Not really. It doesn't have much holiday. But it, like, talks about Thanksgiving and Christmas wedding type thing. I don't know if I'm making sense. But, um, and then Libby left because yesterday was her birthday. And she had dinner with her family. And so I actually was watching 50. Um, and I fell asleep for two and a half hours. So, and it was just, like, random. I woke up in... I woke up laying on my couch because Libby had left and I was like, I'm going to watch 50. And so I did, but I fell asleep and literally I woke up, I was sitting there and then I hear a knock at the door and it's Libby. And I was just like, what the heck just happened? Like, I literally just passed out for two and a half hours. And um, we actually finished watching the Haiti game because we didn't, we had like 20 minutes left of it before she had to go to dinner. So we finished it and then we just kind of hung out. I think I was laying down in bed by 9 30 and it was so hard for me to fall asleep because I like I said I had 
been asleep for two and a half hours but basically i woke up this morning at seven i kind of i didn't sleep in i woke up at or i got out of bed at eight so i like i had a relaxing morning because i had no i have no finals today um it's 11 30 and i've literally done nothing um but yeah i chilled in bed until eight i got up i journaled i did pilates i took a shower i washed my hair actually and it smells really good anyways <laughs> And basically, I played Sims for an hour trying to get myself some fun time. And then I actually just posted a YouTube video. I actually had it uploaded last Wednesday, but it was uh, private. And I just decided to publish it uh, publicly. It was actually an English project, but I thought it would just be fun to do that. I wanted to complete my English final today, but I think that may just be a Thursday thing because... Um, I feel like today and tomorrow I'm just going to be studying, but maybe maybe towards the end of the, the night today I'll want to start my English, but really what I want to do is I want to read this book. I started this yesterday. Um, it was my book of the month for December, um, and I'm like I'm not that far into it. I'm only 68 pages in chapter 5, so that's basically nothing, and I would really like to start reading this, but I also want to finish... Ah, I also want to finish vlogmas so like i have a lot of things i want to do i want to finish all my vlogmas videos i want to finish that book and i need to study for chemistry and obviously chemistry is my top priority i actually asked my boyfriend if he could help me study because he doesn't have to take it because he did so well um during the class so yeah i'm just gonna keep on watching vlogmas and i will talk to you guys later okay so it's 11:52. this is actually really frustrating um i feel like in some of my past vlogs i have mentioned this and it's it like just started happening but something is wrong with my camera or my sd card to where when i go to uh view it even on my camera it says mp4 cannot be played um because there's like uh, a file error and basically i've showed this so many times but i use this to transfer it to my phone and so transfer it to my phone and then i airdrop it to my laptop i also have an adapter that lets my sd card go straight to my laptop i have tried all three so like transferring the sd to my phone transferring the sd to my laptop and then just viewing it on my camera it's just like it's not able to be viewed because the format is weird and i don't really know why sometimes it does that and sometimes it doesn't um so if you guys know like i i don't even know like sometimes i'll just miss vlogs so like i, I film and then i can't view them and that footage is gone and it's really upsetting because i vlogged this past weekend um my boyfriend and i and i went on a date and i vlogged it and i just like lost all that footage of us and it's just like really sad because um even if like i couldn't i couldn't make a video about it like i still want the videos because they were really cute so that's just frustrating but anyways i was going to watch my vlogmas videos and then edit my vlog that i i vlogged this past weekend but i can't do that because most of my videos um were corrupted like i literally only have three videos Four videos from this weekend and they just wouldn't make any sense because it's talking about you know the past weekend so that's just really frustrating um and yeah i don't really know i think i'm just going to chill um i'm still watching my vlogmas videos obviously i think i've said that like five times um, some things that I did is I emailed or I texted my boss at McAllister's from my hometown. So basically last year in the spring semester, I got a job at McAllister's in Lawrence because obviously I go to the University of Kansas and I, um, sorry, I worked there and then I transferred to my hometown's McAllister's. And so since I'm going to be back for a month, I emailed them or texted them that I was wanting to work over break. Um, so I just did that, got that all scheduled out. I also got an email because I'm taking one winter course, um, a four week course, and it literally starts next Monday. So I'm quite literally um, not going to have a break 
which is kind of sad but it's only one class through credit hours it shouldn't be too bad and it's on a subject that i really enjoy um versus like the summer where i had um introduction to psych research and then calc 2 those classes were not fun um so hopefully this class is another wgss class slash anthropology um in the summer i took three classes and the third one was wgss introduction which i love that class so this is kind of like another class about that so i'm really excited for it i think it's called anthropology of women men and transgender individuals and so i'm really excited for it i was looking at kind of the rubric and stuff i'm not going to worry about it until this weekend because i need to get through my classes first but yeah that's just a little update I'm vlogging Meet my boyfriend. What's your name? You wanna watch anime? Oh my gosh, I cannot. My name's London. Oh my god. Okay guys, so I actually just did exam one. I did it so quickly. So that makes me feel really good. I think I only got a few things wrong. Um, which again, <laughs> makes me feel better <laughs> about myself. Um, but i need to do exam two now so basically what i'm just doing is i'm clearing the page and then i pull up the answer key and then after i complete one page then i check my work um that's how i did exam one and it went really fast so hopefully i can do exam two and have no issues that is the goal okay guys really really exciting stuff i actually just went on rounds and i got a package notification and it's from Libby's mom. We actually just got done with rounds. I ate dinner first, so we went on rounds a little late. So it's 7.54. Usually we get done around 7.30, maybe a little earlier if rounds go fast. Um, and we started at 7.30, so um, yeah, 7.54. Since I'm almost done with my second exam, that's all I wanted to do tonight. So I think we're gonna hang out, but no way. Guys, this is actually funny. Last year in the dorm, Libby had this tree, and I have been so jealous of it. I thought it was the cutest thing, and I have zero holiday de decorations, so this is literally amazing. You're joking. Guys, is this not the cutest thing? Wow, I love it. It's so cute. I don't know if it's missing a ball on accident. Hopefully not. Holly, I don't think you're watching this, but thank you so much. Hey, good morning guys. It is Wednesday. Um, I tried to show you guys what I did this morning. It's currently 8.40. Um, I woke up at 7 and I kind of just did my normal routine as if I had class at 9. So, oh, sorry. That's good as it's going to get. But yeah, it is 8.40 a.m. I got ready as if it was a normal school day. So I woke up at 7. I journaled, worked out. I took a shower. I just washed my face, brushed my teeth. And um, right now, usually I'd be leaving for class, but I decided to get a Starbucks drink. I wanted the chestnut praline, but I asked and they didn't have it. So I was just like, I'll just try the sugar cookie almond latte, almond milk latte. I got this hot when it first came out and I did not like it. And so I probably should have gotten a tall, I got a grande, um, but I got it iced. So hopefully that's better. So we're gonna do a taste test. I also got some oatmeal, um, I got the real medley's apple walnuts um it looks super good probably not as healthy as like making your own overnight oats but i'm really excited for that i don't know for me personally it does not taste like a cookie and i am not a fan of the coffee taste and so i just taste coffee so, not my favorite, 
so i'll just know like next time either get more pumps of sugar cookie or don't get that at all for today is to go through um exam three and exam four for my chemistry um to prepare for the exam that's at 4 30. i don't really have anything else going on before then i just really want to focus on that um i did want to read a bit i actually almost finished catching up with all my vlogmas because i know yesterday i was like i need to study for chemistry i want to finish my book and i also want to finish vlogmas videos and so i almost finished vlogmas videos i think i have um one from yesterday and then all the rest are from today i think i have three from today so far so that's only four videos um so i think i'm just gonna eat breakfast and drink this and watch those and then i think i'm gonna have a chill morning maybe like read from 9 to 10 and then start studying that way i'm not studying a lot i don't know <laughs> um but i'll talk to you guys soon it is 9 52 i am getting a little restless so i think it is time to start looking over chemistry um i'm almost done with this book or i'm 60 percent through um i'm on chapter 17 and there's 25 chapters but um yeah i'm gonna just start chemistry right now and get some stuff done okay guys haven't talked to you guys in forever it is currently 305 which means my final is in an hour and 25 minutes i am honestly feeling good london actually came over and he helped me look over exam three and exam four info um and it was really nice to have him here to help me out i don't know if i explained this but this final is actually um optional so basically his classes you drop the lowest score um lowest test score and so for people that did well on all their exams or got a's or like good grades on their exams they don't have to take it i unfortunately did not do well on my second exam i did really bad um my first exam was the best i did and then my second or my third and fourth exam were around the same grade so my second test is just really an outlier um, compared to my other grades. And so that's why I am taking the test instead of not because I want to try to get my grade to go up, obviously. Um, but anyways, I don't know why I explained that. Okay, hey guys, long time no talk today. It is Thursday. Oh, this lighting is just so good. Um, it is currently 9.20 a.m., 9.21 actually. And I need to update you guys on what has really happened. So first off, I'll talk about yesterday. Yesterday, don't remember the last time I talked to you, London came over for like an hour, I think, to help me go over exam three and four. And I went to my exam, I took it, it went well. It took me exactly an hour actually, which was the required amount of time that we had to stay to get partial credit, um, which worked out for me perfectly. But what was crazy is we, while we were taking my final exam everyone like probably they had to split us into two rooms so i think my room had like 80 some people because it our last names are at the beginning of the alphabet and there was less of us and all 80 of our phones just started like going off like about a severe thunderstorm we obviously couldn't look at our phones so we were like is it a tornado like i was worried about it being a tornado because actually when i was walking to budig um where my final was um which is just like a a building on campus if you guys want to know more about KU campus but while I was walking there I was like okay it's super windy we had like gusts up to 80 miles per hour yesterday and the weather when it goes hot to cold is <laughs> super wet windy and the scar sky gets kind of dark that's when you know like the tornado watch weather um and we actually had one in Manhattan which is where K-State is so that's like two hours away I'm pretty sure and I think it's west um but um yeah so there was I, I think there was an actual tornado there or maybe just a tornado watch and then i know there are two tornadoes in two other kansas um cities but i don't know enough about about it like which cities to say but um yeah so i was just nervous and it was super rainy and windy and i did not want to walk back so i didn't get back here until like 6 30 or something i waited like an hour um but thankfully my friend anna's roommate's boyfriend gave us uh both rights i finished this book i'm pretty sure i showed it 
somewhere throughout this vlog. It's really cute. I rated it 4 out of 5 stars. Um, if you guys want a cute holiday romance that has no steam, um, that might actually make people not want to read it. I mean, it's like, there's like tension, but nothing happens. There's no sex scenes or anything like that. So if you want to read a book like that, I would recommend this. It was really cute. 8 p.m. last night, Libby and I watched The Amazing Spider-Man, which is the first Andrew um, Spider-Man movie, and it's my first time watching it. I, we actually have been watching all the Spider-Mans. We watched the Tobey Maguire. He has three. Those were, that was my first time ever watching them, and then today we're gonna watch Andrew's second, and then hopefully we're gonna watch, um, Tom Holland's <laughs> two before we see the movie tonight, but, um, yeah, so there's just a lot on the agenda today. I actually need to pick up my room because it is a absolute disaster. Like, it's just so messy. I feel like that clip did not show that it was messy, but I promise it is. But real fast, I did vlog my breakfast this morning. I'm gonna put in a little clip right now. I know the video <laughs> clip doesn't look that good, but I had avocado toast. I kind of made my own. So I, um, I live in, oh my gosh, my battery is flashing really fast. I live in a dorm and so we have a dining hall in my dorm or the dorm connected to mine. And I went there, I got two toasted wheat breads, two butters, I got scrambled eggs, an avocado, and that's what I just put on it. And then I actually got this matcha and it is so good. I'll put what's on it or what's in here right here. But this is so good. I actually love it so much. This is only my second time ever trying matcha and this one is so good. The first time I had it, I just got the regular um, basic iced green tea latte with oat milk or something like that. This one has uh, sweet cold foam or something like that. So it's a lot sweeter. Um, which is probably why I like it, but yeah, I'm gonna start cleaning up my room I was gonna do a time lapse, but my battery is flashing So I will see you guys soon. Hey, 11 40 a.m. I'm so bad that it's still a.m. I don't know why but I Get really sad when it becomes p.m. Is that weird? I don't know why I think I'm just more productive in In the morning and I feel like I still have day left I feel like it also goes slower for some reason, but I swear as soon as it turns 12 p.m., I swear the clock just, like, goes so fast. I don't know if I'm making any sense. Maybe I'm just being silly, but anyways, I wanted to update you guys. My camera is finally done charging. My room is still a mess, so I still need to clean that, so you guys will get to see that. I did do a little pickup before, um, before I started doing work. I actually started doing work around 9 30 i guess i could look i'm gonna show you guys kind of my um setup for doing papers um so yeah why not i'm not gonna show or wait what i'm gonna show you first i'm gonna look at when i started yeah so i think i started my paper around 9 40 which is crazy because it's actually 11 40 or i started my final at 9 40 and i start or i started my final around 9 40 a.m it's a, currently 11 41 a.m nope 11 42 a.m now um, and so I, the final was only supposed to take two hours and 30 minutes. That's as long as it's supposed to take. And it's, um, two sections. And the first section is two essays. She gave us, um, a whole bunch of prompts of questions that we could answer. And we had to pick two of the questions. Those are our two essays. And each of the essays, they had to have four different pieces of work. So no repeating. But um, the second section, which is the sections were 75% of the grade, which is why it probably it took me two hours. And then I'm assuming the second section is only gonna take me around 30 minutes, um, or I'm gonna try to have it around 30 minutes. That way I'm following the two hour, two and a half hour uh, window. Um, but it's not due until tomorrow, Friday, 12 a.m. <laughs> um, or Friday, 11.59 p.m. But, um, but anyways, I finished the first section. I literally just have like my first draft. Usually I honestly don't do first drafts or final drafts. I feel like maybe I did do a first draft. I'm gonna show you guys my setup for this. I actually had her in another class, so I basically did the same exact thing. So first, this is what she gave us. So part one is two essays, essay one, uh, four works and four different works. That's what I just said. And then part two is a funky question. So this is worth 75. This is worth 25. And these were kind of all the topics that she said maybe discussed in the questions. Um, this was before we had the actual prompts. So this is what I did. So section one, I picked out my two questions that I had. So um, D was the notion of loss or death. Um, kind of how does the author make meaning of it? And then my second question was how does gender 
um, influence or like what is the importance of gender. And so those were my two things. And the reason that I chose those is because I started listing out A, B, C, D, and I did, I put all the works that I could talk about for each category. And I thought that D and H were the ones that I had the strongest um, opinion on or like things. And then I kind of picked my four works. So this is what I consider maybe my first draft. So I picked the Aguero sisters and then I kind of talked about it. I heard a fly buzz. Um, the bustle in the house and then to the lighthouse so those are my four works i talked about it and then i just wrote about it and i transferred it over here so this is my first essay right here to up here and it's about 754 words and then i did the same exact thing so professions for women the flea to his coy mistress and then sonnet 130 and then um again i wrote and this one's about 100 words less i think it's 650 but it's so good. And then, like I said, section two hasn't been done yet, but this one's really fun. Um, it's only worth 25%. I'm just going to choose five characters from anything. It can be any of these that I already have talked about, but I guess this is technically my first draft. And then this is my second draft. And then basically what I'm going to do is I'm just going to read through it. Probably, I'll probably read through it a little bit later because I don't want to look at it right now since I've been looking at it for two hours. Um, but, yeah, um, that's basically it. I'm not sure if she wants us to do this, like, MLA formatting. I'll probably just do the title and then kind of keep it how I have it. But my plan is, is I'm going to step away from this. Libby and I are going to be watching, um, Andrew's second Spider-Man. And then hopefully we can get at least Homecoming in, um, before tonight when we watch the, the new, um, what is it? Far From Home? No Way Home? Why am I forgetting it? No Way Home. Oh my gosh. Far Far From Home is the second Tom Holland. Anyway, sorry. Um, so yeah, I'm going to step away from this. I really want to clean up my room real fast. I just want to curl my hair before um, I go over to Libby's because I'm not really sure how that's going to go. So I'm going to do a time lapse of me picking up my room. So sorry guys. My closet I have so many clothes, like this is embarrassing. Hey okay, guys, so I did my hair. I still need to do my bangs, so obviously they're kind of weird, but I don't want to do that until closer um, to the time that we need to watch the movie. But yeah, um, I just curled my hair. I also did my makeup for just fun, I guess. I'm waiting for Libby to get back from QT so we can watch the movie. I think I'm just gonna go over there, maybe take my laptop because maybe I will wanna look at my essay. I doubt I will, um, but we are gonna watch that and I'll bring my camera this time because last night I did not do that. Um, but yeah, there's the update. Okay. Hey. hey guys, Libby and I just watched Amazing Spider-Man 2 and homecoming it was my first time watching either of those they were really good i'm sad that we don't have enough time to watch far from home but i think it'll be fine it's we have like two hours until we need to leave probably so we could watch it no i'm just kidding but um anyways we're about to go or Libby's about to go with me to ncc i want another matcha and i want to get dinner as well um but yeah, the movies were really good. I actually really liked Amazing Spider-Man 2. Um, it made me cry a little bit. I actually really liked it. I don't think Andrew Garfield is that bad, but I will say he's my least favorite out of the three. But I don't think he's a bad Spider-Man. How would you rank them? I think I already know, but. Tom, Toby, uh, Andrew. But I will That's say good. Amazing Spider-Man 2 is like a really good movie. Like I really liked Amazing Spider-Man 2. Um, anyways. Can I talk to them? Yeah. It was already on you. I think... Wait, do you have a trash can in there? Yeah, it's in my closet right there. I think that Toby... This is weird. Do I look in the lens or? I always look at myself, but you're supposed to look okay. in the lens, but like it's fine. I think Toby is by far the best Spider-Man. 
I and like then Tom. I feel like it's based off of like who you first saw as Spider-Man. That's what I said. And I saw Tom. Yeah, I agree yeah. with you. She saw Tom first. But the first. thing is, is like I also just think Tom is funnier, and he looks He's like funny. a teenager, and his action scenes are just better. And of course, that's because his films were made later, obviously. Mm-hmm. But I think he is just better. Yeah. I have been watching Toby since I was like five years old, so he will always be my favorite Spider-Man. But I don't think I don't think you've ever seen me cry. But tonight, if Toby's not in the movie, or if Toby dies in the movie, I well, will probably cry. I think it, he's. I'm just expecting him not to be in it. Like I'm not expecting them to be in it. I am. I'm not. I have expectations. Uh, and that's why you're gonna get disappointed, well, Libby. I know, but. Straw Man, hat goofy was, on TikTok. That was harsh, and that's he why you're gonna it. get disappointed, Lemmy. Anyways. Anyways, time for dinner. Bye. Peace, love. Bye, guys. Toby. Oh, and scream. I think this is illegal. It's currently 8.45 a.m. Actually, just got back from the dining hall. I had more avocado toast. I just have to say, it is so good. I can't believe I, like, actively chose to miss out on trying it multiple times. Um, but it was, re it's really good. Um, and, like, I'm making some from dining hall food. So I can't imagine what, like, an actual restaurant or, like, making it at home would be like. Basically, just for your guys' knowledge, the agenda is... Oh, first off, Spider-Man No Way Home was so good. Uh, I'm not going to spoil it, obviously, because I know, it. like, today a lot of people are watching it. And also, I mean, this video this video is going to be out uh, on Monday, hopefully, fingers crossed. And so, hopefully more people have seen it. But I'm not going to spoil it, just in case... It was so good. I think it is one of my favorite Marvel movies. I don't think it's the best movie to ever be created. Um, I do think it's one of the best Marvel movies though. I couldn't, I don't think I could choose what my favorite Marvel movie is, but it was really good. I thought the friendship dynamics were really good. The uh, fight scenes were amazing. Actors were phenom phenomenal. And I'm really glad because this is confirmed, so it's not spoiling anything, but we know, like, like, Dr. Ock, or is it Doc Ock? Doc Ock, Green Goblin, um, we knew that Electro was in it, um, uh, I think those were the only three confirmed, maybe? Um, so, so we knew all of those were in it, and, like, two of those are, um, Tobey Maguire's Spider-Man enemy, and then one of them is... Andrew Garfield's Spider-Man Enemy, and so I'm really glad Libby and I watched all of them. Um, leading up to this, we watched all three of the original Spider-Man, um, and then we watched uh, Andrew Garfield's two Spider-Mans, and then we watched Homecoming, and then we watched the ending of um, No Way Home? No, Far From Home. Sorry, Far From Home. Just to